Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of K-Pop Hot Takes. So today I'm gonna give you all three quick reasons why you should get into Astro as a group. Now! Before I get there, firstly, who are Astro? Astro are a six member group that debuted in 2016 under Fantago Entertainment, consisting of members MJ, Jin Jin, Onu, Moonbin, Rocky, and Sana. That's in age order. Um, the leader is Jin Jin, who's a very good rapper and a very attractive man. But that's a story for another time. The music started off quite um, pop rock leaning, happy, um, feel good, bright energy. And it suited the personalities very well. But there's always an undercurrent of like a strong bass in their music, which I really found surprising, as well as really great harmonization. Really good harmonies, really good stacked vocals. Like they really did a very good, like it's always like a wall of sound when I listen to their music, especially in their debut. Um, probably actually the first three releases, the first three mini albums, they showcase that very well. And they've certainly grown and matured and you can see that throughout their career, which is great because you get to see that they, they know and they're aware of their artistry and what they want to give to their fans, the Arrojas. Before I give you the reasons also, I just want to add, I first discovered Astro when I saw the crazy sexy cool dance practice on my YouTube channel and a particular dancer with a checkered shirt stood up to me and I immediately went to the comments because I was like, who? I knew, I was like, that's not just me seeing that. And lo and behold, everyone was like, yep, that's Rocky, that's Rocky. And if you don't know already, I've spoken about him on my top 10 male dancers list video on this channel. And um, that's how I kind of like found Astro. And I love that song a lot. Uh, it suited, I know I hadn't heard anything like that in K-pop and I hadn't seen anyone dance like him in K-pop. So I was interested and I was, so Astro's been on my radar since then. And then recently I listened to their B-sides on my other channel on YouTube Live and got to really hear their artistry and I've and I loved every second of it. Firstly, you should get into Astro because it can sing and their music is really good. MJ in particular has one of the most prettiest angelic voices I've heard in all of K-pop. And he's refreshing because sometimes it's not just about having the biggest, most impressive voice, it's about having a voice that emotes really well and it has a nice, pretty tone. That's, he's just, and he's got range as well, but it's just never overpowering. It's always expressive and kind of like romantic in the way that he sings. So, and also they've got Rocky and Rocky is not even, he's a main dancer, but he's also a good rapper and a good singer. And that's just, that's just a nice mix to have, period. And then you have Jin Jin, who's a great rapper and a great performer. So, and he carries and he's got a great tone and you know they all sound so good to fit moonbin sana everyone sounds great everyone sounds really good only when, only when he's singing and they've done acoustic performances and they're all, all harmonizing together the music makes you feel good and they've kept it that way pretty much up until recently which it's nice because a lot of K-pop groups do try to force to be a bit edgy and a bit sexier but they've naturally grown to that point and they've kept a nice feel-good energy about them so if you want a good vibe the music is Astro is the one for you and then secondly their personalities Woo these guys are so funny so MJ is the oldest member, but he's kind of the most chaotic one. If you watch their um, When Boss Falls Asleep ASMR video, I barely laughed. Like, I found that video so funny. Uh, you have to watch it. You just have to watch it. Um, also, Jin Jin, the, old, the, the leader, he's also crazy. He's also chaotic. Like, they all just, even Moonbin, they all are full of, like, so much fun. I feel like whenever I think of Astro, I just think of them laughing a lot. I feel like they just laugh a lot and they have so much joy. And it shows in their music because that's basically the sound that they kind of incorporate. And last but not least, is their performance skills. So Astro, to me anyway, I could be wrong, they kind of specialize in light footwork and quick um, feathery transitions and jumps. They are so great at that and I guess it goes with the music because the music is light, bright and uplifting. So when they dance, they never feel heavy. They always feel very, like, almost like, like, like they have wings. And I love that about them. Obviously I've spoken about Rocky, 
um, being one of my favorite dancers in K-pop. But Moonbin also, Moonbin and Jinjin are also great dancers. Um, especially, and you know, if you look at Moonbin's fan camps as well, he's got the posture of like, me and my friend always say, he runs up like a tango dancers like I can see one dancing with the stars or something like that we need that in Korea their performance skills definitely are up there because in the core the routines are so great when you see Rocky spins I, they, they just bring you joy and it's just refreshing it's just so it makes you feel happy I would highly recommend for the songs I would recommend um for so you so you want to hear so you hear a bit of the range of what I'm talking about you have to check out Growing Pains Innocent Love from this like early early stuff um Go and Stop which is from the more recent stuff but also Like a King which was Jin Jin's separate stuff oh my god I discovered that on the b-sides listen wow and also All I Wanna Do from Sanha and Moonbin's um unit project wow yeah that's for Koreans like I just yeah they, the, the range and the production and what they can do chef's kiss so yeah I think now will be the perfect time to get into Astro because the youngest member has now like officially become an adult so I was told you know they were kind of waiting for that so that they can explore a lot more mature sexier um sensual concepts which they kind of did recently with one so um this is the perfect time to get into them because they've been about five years now this is when groups would then even grow a lot more and can be adventurous because they know the fan base is there for them so i'm looking forward to what they bring in i'm so glad i discovered more of the music and i'm looking forward to the next comebacks thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed this I hope you learned a little bit about astro if you want me to do videos about any other groups that you want me to explore i can do some live listening sessions on my other channel and then do videos, videos about them here so let me know leave a comment see ya bye